Well, the skills that students need to be learning in school today are, um, cover a huge spectrum. Um, I mean, the, the traditional skills of being able to, to read um, and to read intelligently and to write and write clearly, those, uh, no matter, I think, no matter what happens in the world, no matter how fast the world changes, those skills still need to be acquired um, by students. But they're not acquired by preparing them for standardized tests and boring the hell out of students and squeezing the joy out of learning for everybody. But anyway, those traditional skills and, and the skills of mathematics and so on, all those need to be learned. But as, as we all know, the world is changing um, faster than, than we can, can even figure out um, what the new questions are. So we need to, to be developing kids who can think creatively. And consequently, one of the things that in American schools is at the bottom of, of the sort of priority list, I think should be at the top, namely the arts. Places where kids can learn how to be creative, where self-expression can happen in, in, a, in a joyful way um, and in a um, in, in kind of in an out of the box environment, and of course our schools are just the opposite of that. So there needs to be, as the world continues to change, these traditional skills, but there needs to be um, kind of new thinking and people who can actually think of the of new questions rather than trying to answer questions on a test that somebody else has already figured out. Yeah.